<laughs> Hello guys, it's the morning time and I just, I didn't just wake up, I actually cleaned our bathroom a while ago because my grandma wanted me to clean it and normally I would have vlogged it but you guys see me do it like twice so I'm like I don't need to vlog it every time I clean the bathroom because it just gets really repetitive and just very boring so I didn't vlog that but I do have the vacuum in my room up but um I don't know if I want to vlog that because I'm in like a nightgown right now and that will be too much like I probably would change because like you're gonna be seeing my legs i don't want you guys seeing those because i'm ever so self-conscious so that's just my real for you but um yeah i gotta i gotta clean up my room and vacuum it and then after that i can just start on my normal day i'm actually gonna make me some chicken and dumpling soup because i just love eating soup whenever i'm sick and I'm just going to do the salt water treatment morning, afternoon, and night to get rid of my sore throat because I got no time to be sick. My immune system is just ever so bad. So if you're sick and you touch me, I'm going to catch it like, like that because it's that bad. So I just got over being sick. So now I got to get over being sick again. So uh, that's my life for you. So... I'm going to go ahead and get my room vacuumed because I really don't want to put it off for so long. So I vacuumed my room up. As you can see, I don't know how well this angle is, but I did. And I put on some pants because I'm just like, I don't want you guys seeing my legs. I'm going to take them off after this. Out of breath because vacuuming takes a lot out of you, especially if you're a bigger person. So um, I'm dying. Not really. I'm not dying, knocking on wood. But um, yeah, it's just very taxing so I'm gonna clean up my dresser now because it needs to be cleaned like every inch of my room so hopefully I can get a good angle so you can see my whole dresser hopefully I can find something but if I can't I will try to angle it away from my dresser so you can still see some stuff why but this figure keeps falling every time i stack it i don't know why leap day why do you keep falling the world will never know Alrighty, so i gotta put him back up on my figure shelf i'm actually pretty sad because um recently my grandmother accidentally threw away my zelda figure so all i have is link and cheek i'm gonna need to rebuy her because I miss Zelda, I just miss her being there. But my GameStop actually had Pit, so maybe I'll replace her with Pit. I don't know. But I'm gonna need to get my Disgaea 4 game back on where it's at. I may not put it back because I'm gonna play that later because I'm hoping to beat it. I haven't had time to pretty much level up anymore, so that's the reason why I haven't beaten it yet. But I am gonna beat this today, hopefully. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Alrighty, so as you saw, I have a whole bunch of clothes piled up there, and I'm going to have to sort them out. And like you see, I'm not the neatest with my clothes, but I really feel like it doesn't really matter. But, um, yeah, so in case you guys couldn't get a really good look at it, um, here is my free Iwatobi Swim Club shirt. I think I might just show you guys all of my anime shirts, because why not? So hold on. Alrighty, so I have them all laid out here. So I have quite a bit. I didn't really get these all in one go because these are expensive. If you guys have any, like, interest in buying, like, anime graphic tees or, like, video game graphic tees, 
save up the money for them because they are quite pricey if I do say so myself. So I'm going to show you all of them. Most of them, not most of them, like two or three of them are video games, but I think I figured to throw them in here. But um, here's actually a Kingdom Hearts shirt I got a long time ago. And I got this the first time I went to the mall that's in the town ahead of me. I think it's like two towns over but I got it there because that was our first time going and I really wanted to buy something cool so I got this and me and my sister actually got matching shirts so I have this and my sister have this because the mall had two different kinds of Kingdom Hearts shirts and we just decided this was the coolest one to buy so that is that I need to iron them because they are like ever so wrinkly and here is my Soul Eater shirt this is the newest shirt I actually got I haven't gotten any new shirts after this but um yeah this is my soul eater shirt and I really like this and yes so um here is my Legend of Zelda shirt and I love all the colors and so this shirt is actually really big on me because they only have 3x and I normally wear one or 2x so it looks like a dress on me but I really don't care because it looks like a pretty dress so um yes and all these shirts I bought off a of Hot Topic. So um, here is my Oran High School Host Club. These are really um, wrinkly, but this is my host, my Oran. Sorry high school host club shirt and i this is the first shirt i ever got that was anime so um yes i love how full printed this is and i love that people can see all of the characters instead of like one so my next shirt is actually a shirt everyone on instagram wants to steal from me but um this is my black butler shirt i got this after i got really into black butler because i caught it really late because everyone was really into it and i I was like nope I don't like it but then I watched it and I'm like I love Black Butler and I was debating because Hot Topic had this shirt and a full print of Grell and I'm like do I want the the fabulous husband or just CL and Sebastian so I decided to get CL and Sebastian and just come back later for Grell but the shirt got sold out so I'm like cries for freaking days and here is my free Iwatobi swim club shirt and this is another shirt people try to steal from me not actually steal but you know jelly steal <laughs> But, um, yeah, so here is my free shirt, and this is the only coolest free shirt I have seen because it's full print, and you can see all the bays, and I love this shirt, and guys, I'm missing a shirt, I'm missing one, so hold on, hold on. Alrighty, so I got this one, I forgot I had this for a moment, but here is my bleach shirt, I actually bought this the same time I bought my Keenum Heart shirt, but I believe this was like only $14 instead of of that pricey cost that my Kingdom Hearts shirt costed me. So, um, yes, I would have liked it a lot more if Rukia wasn't there, but like, I find it really shisty how they have everyone but Orihime. I forgot to mention this because I've just been so focused on getting these away. But, um, if you ever order a shirt from Hot Topic that's like this, um, order in a size above of you because these shirts are a little snug. So, that's the reason why a lot of these shirts are big. Bigger, they are a bigger size than what I actually wear because I just really don't like tight shirts. So again, if you ever buy a shirt from Hot Topic, order it in a size above. Unless you really like tight shirts, I don't know, but that's just me. So just saying. I wanted to share this shirt with you guys, but I actually do have a shirt for Hump Day. <laughs> and all of my friends and my teachers love this shirt for me. Like they're just like, oh my gosh, where did you get this shirt? And honestly, my brother brought it home I don't know if he got it from a fair or whatnot I don't know where he got it but he brought it home and I'm like I have to have this shirt so I try to wear it every Wednesday if I remember that I do have this shirt but most of the times I forget that I have this shirt I'm sorry for showing off my shirts but this one I have to show because it makes me mad I never thought I would just be mad at a shirt but like the quote is basically don't take apples from strangers and it has snow white on here but yet it's very hypocritical because she took an apple from a stranger am i was deeply upset with me with this but before i open this drawer 
I am sorry. So I still have all of my Barbie dolls. Like legit. I've had these for years. And like some are better than others. Like me and my sister was obsessed with Barbie dolls. And um, we used to reenact stories that we would make up on the spot with these dolls. And you you can really get really creative with things that don't move. And we used to move them and stuff. So yeah, I did have some Bratz dolls. But I, I lost their shoes. Because their shoes come off like that. And I'm like, wait a minute. So... I just have a lot of dolls that I just have no use for. So, and I used to make this a boy doll. So this is like my first bishy that I've ever made. Because I'm like, this looks like a boy. So yes, this is my official first bishy non-anime character. So maybe I'll make it, I'll make him into a, like a bishy. This go figure. So yep, I still have a lot of this. A lot of these are my sister's. So, the nicer ones are my sister's and the ugly ones are mine. Alrighty, so my January sketchbook update has been uploaded right now. And I have to add the end screen plus the annotations to it. So, um, people can subscribe and stuff. And I'm really liking this because before they added this feature, I'm always, I always wondered how people did it. But I'm just like, I just love this. Yes, I may not have like a template, like a professionally done template, but I like it. Like, you know, it's just something about it that just screams cool. Alrighty, so I decided to get out my room for once and do art in a different place because I feel like as artists, we need to move around and um, change our environments. So, um... <coughs> I thought I could do my collab with Dominica and my kitchen because it's very peaceful and it's very quiet. So, um, shoot. That means I can't upload this vlog until after the videos are up. I have enough vlogs to make it, so it's okay. Alrighty, guys. So, I am outside and I'm going to check if the mail came. I doubt it came. It's like 11 o'clock and the mail barely comes at 11 so I'm gonna just go see I'm not expecting anything so it's not like I'm gonna go to the mailbox and flip out so um yeah it's really windy outside and it's been windy for the past couple of days alright moment of truth nothing came that's okay though I think it's gonna come around 12 like our mail is like very bipolar like sometimes they come at like 11 sometimes they come at 12 and i'm like pick a time just to come Alrighty, take two of getting the mail i think the mail came because one of my neighbors just got his and it would be cold if it wasn't windy so it's always good so let's see if it came And it did. Hey guys, it's Sorrel here, and I'm sorry if I didn't vlog for like hours. I was actually in a Skype call with the Bay Nautica, so I just dedicated my time to her because we don't talk a lot, and whenever we do get a chance to talk, I'm just like, Nautica, let me love you. But um, right now, I'm drinking some water because I need to get my body hydrated again, because whenever you're sick, you take you need to drink all your fluids so basically i'm gonna be living off of water and orange juice for the next couple of days because i don't want to be like being congested in school and have to leave every five minutes because my nose is running like you know it's nasty but like i'm gonna be drinking water like that nothing soda nothing juice just water because i'm gonna get my body back hydrated and i just need to kick this out my system like once and for all i actually maybe some apple slices but i almost ate them all and then i made me pb and j because pb and j is actually very healthy for you it's like five o'clock and i'm like lunch time j and i hate that but it's lunch time at like four or five o'clock and then i eat at like nine for dinner which is bad because you're not supposed to eat after eight which i need to start doing because i am bad at that Alrighty, so i've been getting comments on my sketchbook update part one and legit guys you are making my day like 
legit. Like, I am, like, so happy that a lot of you guys like my sketchbook updates because, like, for me, I kind of feel off with sketchbooks. Like, I start them off okay, and then I'm like, the last half is better than the first half. But for you guys saying, hey, I love this, I'm like... Thank you. So, um, woo, my eyes are legit tired, but I don't want to go to sleep right now because it's legit 5 o'clock and my iPod can focus. It's 5 o'clock and I'm like, if I go to sleep now, I won't wake up till like 7. So I'm going to reply to your comments and then get back to my day. I actually do have a video to upload, which is this video is for the Deadly Cupcake Collective. I actually have to find a song for it. Now that I remember, like, geez, guys, I forget everything. Alrighty, guys, so it's like 9.36 right now. I'm so tired. Like, I'm not tired, like, physically. I'm tired, like, drained. Because when you're sick, you're just tired but i'm not one to stay in bed all day for sickness so yeah so um i'm actually talking to mama right now she had to go eat so she said she'll call me back but like we're dying in laughter because we're doing the hago meme together and we're just doing our characters in these lewd faces and i'm like it's the most funnest thing ever and i was really shocked that we have not gotten a lot of requests like i would have thought since we well since i'm surprised i didn't get a lot of requests because i draw guys all the time i really am glad for requests i did get because i'm having so much fun with this so um don't y'all be shy see and after this video y'all request because it ain't gonna happen guys request when it was up i might just do the ones that i have now and just not do them anymore because i don't want to be doing it all the time and just running out my energy for no other drawings so I'm just gonna finish the ones I have and then I'll move on to something else alrighty guys so this is gonna be it for the vlog I have my jacket on because I got really cold and I feel like when you're sick you need to keep your body warm I don't know that's just something I believe in but basically I just got off a Skype call with Mama Cupcake we basically were talking for the rest of the afternoon. I think we started around like 5 or 6. And then we stopped at legit 11. Because we were just doing the um, Hego face meme the whole time. And we were just dying in laughter doing that meme. So um, I really do recommend it. If you have a friend that you're close to, do that meme. Because it's so fun. Like at first I was like, ew, I don't want to do it. But, um, it's legit the funnest thing ever if you actually pick characters that fit the faces. So that's it, guys. So I will see you in my next vlog. So, bye-bye.